transport anybody until those buses are up and running. So I don't know what the families are going to do at this point. A private school in Nampa, two buses out of commission, vandalized, their catalytic converters stolen. CBS 2's Michaela Ellich spoke with the owner of the private school about what they're going to do now. Hallways and classrooms lay empty in preparation for the first day of school tomorrow. A day normally filled with rainbows and excitement, but that's not the case for Kangaroo Academy. Because on Monday, Jennifer Kopis, owner of Kangaroo Clubhouse, came to find that two catalytic converters were stolen out of the school buses, leaving some parents in a sticky situation. There's a lot of parents that are really upset, frustrated, nervous. They don't really know what they're going to do come tomorrow, and neither do we. <laughs> it was here on the corner of 15th Ave North and 6th Street North in Nampa where the two school buses that provided transportation for over 50 students now vanished leaving kids with no source of transportation for school. I'm afraid that kids will be going home um, after school alone or having to get on the bus by themselves or walking to school by themselves. Just today, a GoFundMe page was started to help fix the buses. And so far, $155 has been donated, but it's a long ways from its $1,000 goal. We've had multiple people donate, which is amazing. I've been very grateful for everything. <laughs> Jennifer says that she hopes by next week the buses will be up and running for kids to get to school.